Hello, my name is Zaina Amira and I study computer science at Al Hussein Technical University. And this is the website that I've developed for special topics, which is one of the subjects I've taken this semester. And the main purpose of this subject is to create a website from scratch, including the front end and back end, in addition to connecting to a database. So there are many languages and frameworks that I've used, such as HTML, CSS, JavaScript, PHP, along with Ajax and Bootstrap. So the main idea of my website is to teach kids and elderly how to create different figures and shapes of origami. So let's look at the website. In this website, you, there's a lot you can read about. You can read about how to origami. You can read about the company. What is our missions, our visions, our purpose? You can also read about the essential tools needed for origami, such as papers, pencil colors, scissors, along with other things. You can also choose the origami according to category, whether you want to create an animal, flowers, occasions and packaging, and even toys and games. You can also read about the origami history, everything you need to know about origami and the modern origami. You can also read about the best origami instructions in my opinion, but if you have any other opinions, of course you can contact us. So let's say we want to go to the About How to Origami page. It will redirect us to the registration page where we must make an account to continue using the website. So if we want to sign up, let's say our username is test1, the password is test1 as well, and the email is test1 at domain.com, let's say. And then we sign up. As you can see, the sign is a success, so we must sign in now. So we go back to the sign in page. We put our username, test1, and our password. And now we can sign in. It will redirect us back to the home page. So now, if we go back to the About How to Origami page, it will open successfully. Here, it will just talk about what is our purpose. So now if we go to the categories page, we have four main categories, animals, flowers, occasions and packaging, and toys and games. Here are all the origami instructions that you can choose from and learn from. So let's say we want to read about the fish. We want to learn how to make a fish out of paper. Click to learn, it will redirect us to the details page. And as you can see, there are many steps. Step 1 until step 14. So we'll start to teach you step by step on how to make the fish. So let's say we want to learn how to make a box. Here are the instructions to create a box. Same thing. You have steps 1 until steps 9 until step 11. So there's a lot that you can learn from here. So if we go back to the categories, toys and games, as you can see, we have the fortune teller, the cup and hat. You can also see the helpful tips and tricks that you can use in order to create the origami nicely and easily, the way that you want it to be. What's nice about this website is that it's very responsive in terms of it can be used on any type of device you have. So let's say on a mobile phone, it will look like this. If we put it on a tablet, it will look like this. So according to the device, this website can easily be used. So if we want to contact, here you have the contact information, the mobile phone number, the email address. And let's say we want to send us an email, a message, we can use the contact form. So let's say my name is Zena Amire. My email is test1 at gmail.com. Let's say I live in Madaba and the subject is a test because I want to show you what I mean. And the message is Hello, my name is Zena and this website is fun, let's say. We then click on submit 
And that's how you know that you've contacted us successfully. But if you want to think about how's the process behind this all, all this information is inserted into the database. So let's say we go to the database here and we go to contact. All the information will be put over here. And if you want to use this on the phone, the same thing. The phone will also be responsive and you can see the contact form. If you want to see the Facebook, the Google, the LinkedIn, YouTube channels or Instagram, of course, you can also go to those pages from here, from the footer. So last thing, if we want to log out, we click on log out. And that will redirect us back to this page. And that is my website.